Hi everyone, uh, Graham here. Just want to do a little video for you all this week. Um, we've got a few new Zoom tastings we've got scheduled in. We know they've been really, really popular over lockdown and over these last few months. And in the run up to Christmas, which is amazingly and surprisingly close, we've booked in uh, quite a few Zoom tastings with a few more to come as well. We've got a, a wonderful champagne tasting with Louis Roder booked in at the start of December as we try their Brut non-vintage and their, and their Brut vintage. We've got an amazing fine wine tasting actually with an Argentinian winemaker, um, Finca Fleischmann, um, as we try their Dedicado Chardonnay and a Dedicado Grand Reserve Malbec, so two quite big bold styles of wine. Um, in, on two weeks Friday we've got a sherry tasting with Val de Spino. Um, we absolutely love the sort of Val de Spino range, they produce some amazing cherries. We're going to try a Manzanilla and a Monteado and a Pedro Jimenez, so three cherries. Um, with, a, with a wonderful sort of video presentation um, from her F. What's amazing about the cherries, I think, you know, it's unlike wine, you're not going to have to drink those over the weekend as well. They'll last for a good couple of weeks if you can make them last uh, in your fridge. So that's going to be an amazing tasting. But the next one coming up is a week Friday. Um, we're going to taste three wines from a group of winemakers that sort of label themselves together as democratic wines. So they're based uh, in Catalonia, um, so just south of, of Barcelona and they make some, some amazing wines from sparkling wines, still wines, vermouths, um, and, and even really good sangrias actually that, that, that go for a lot of money. Um, but the three wines we're gonna be tasting is a rosé cava, um, really fresh, lovely red fruit. That's gonna be really enjoyable and a nice way to kick off the weekend. And then these two wines, which I, I've casually brought with me and, and sat down on the, on the chair, um, a Cicerolo, um, a really interesting skin contact white wine that's both fresh and yet creamy. It's got some really interesting fruit character. And a Cabernet Sauvignon from Spain, which is actually a little bit more sort of prominent than you might imagine, but, but they make this in a really interesting method. And I don't want to give too much away, but it's a Cabernet Sauvignon like you will not have tried before. Um, so we're going to be joined with both a representative from Democratic Wines and uh, an ex-colleague of mine who now works for The Importer um, and have a really good chat. That should be a really good fun tasting. We're going to book some more in in November as well, um, but if you guys ever want a private tasting, if you want to get you know a bubble of six in one house, maybe a bubble of six in another, and do a little tasting where we taste a few more wines, uh, please just give us a shout. We'd, we'd love to do some tastings with you. Um, and down the bottom of, of this week's email, which this video will, will be embedded into, um, there's a tasting box, and it's a Spanish and um, Portuguese themed tasting box. And so the three wines that form part of this next wine tasting are all in this tasting box. Um, it's a superb you know, chance to try a few new interesting wines in our range and get the wines for the tasting. If you order it, make sure you give us a nudge, remind us to invite you to the Zoom tasting, and hopefully we'll see you all soon. Cheers.